Hi guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how I pin curl my hair and showing you guys how to make your curls last without using heat. So first I'm going to be starting out with curled hair obviously and I'm going to be using these jumbo bobby pins. Starting in the front section of my hair, I'm going to take my shorter layers and make that into one big pin curl. And as you guys can see, the technique that I use, I just kind of wrap it around my finger and then I'll roll it up and then I'll pin it flat to my head. So wrap it, roll it, pin it. So I'm going to pin it diagonally and then take another bobby pin and pin it in the opposite direction, kind of creating an X. So it should look like that and I'm going to be moving on to the second section of my hair and I kind of like to separate it into three sections and do the front part of my hair, the middle, and then the very back because I have layers. Again, using the same technique, wrap it around your finger, roll it up, and then pin it. And just in case some of you guys are wondering, the reason why I like to wrap it is because my hair is so long, so I can't just grab the curl and then just roll it and pin it. I have to wrap it around my finger first because my hair is so long. So I like to do about five pin curls on each side of my head. I really don't like to do more than that because I feel like the curls won't come out as big and voluminous. So I just like to do about four or five on each side. I'm done this is what the pin curls look like and I like to put a bonnet over my head because it's a lot more comfortable for me for when I'm sleeping so it's the next day and I'm gonna take my bonnet off and be taking the bobby pins out and just kind of finger wrecking my curls I also like to feel around my head as you can see just in case I forgot any bobby pins because I have done that before where I found a bobby pin later that day. I'm going to be taking just a little bit of argan oil and just kind of putting that on my ends so they won't be dry. And the curls do come out a lot more bouncy the next day because I guess they were in the pin curl all night. 
but they will fall later throughout the day and I like the looser look, not really the bouncy tight look. So that's pretty much the tutorial. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you found it very, very helpful. And it just takes practice. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys later.